Hi there, my name is Christian and I'm representing the Open Source University. We're providing educational identity for everyone around the world through the Ethereum blockchain. If you find the concept interesting, I'm sure that you'll find the next few minutes interesting as well, because I will share more about the project and also about our work here in Dublin, Ireland, where I'm invited from our uh, local ambassador and a member of the advisory board, Miglen, a long time cloud technology and cyber security professional, advising us on the topic. And of course, the first thing he wanted me to get to be part of was the Blockchain Association of Ireland's conference on the subject of end user threats and uh, vulnerability scenarios. Uh, when we speak of uh, fintech, definitely uh, there are a lot of concerns around the fintech innovation these days, but if we speak about solutions beyond uh, the financial world uh, that are related to uh, implementing blockchain technologies, uh, actually the blockchain, for example, in the field of education is solving these security threats and concerns that are related to the existing uh, ways of operation, whether digital or non-digital. As a, an example, our community manager for Russia, Seva, shared with me just yesterday that uh, in Russia more than 40 million uh, users had their data about their diplomas stolen because of a hack in the governmental agency system uh, database that was managing um, the information. Uh, but um, not only that, uh, in the paper uh, system or way of operation, uh, you see even bigger uh, threats uh, to security and to uh, uh, trust uh, when it comes to learners' credentials. Our community uh, ambassador to India, uh, Ravi, uh, just now uh, sent a link over Skype uh, showing yet another organized uh, crime gang uh, being unveiled by the Indian government that had uh, printed uh, previously more than 50,000 fake uh, school and university diplomas. Uh, so what we end up with is a system where there is no trust and a system where if you have a trusted third party, let's say the government to manage the data, you end up with uh, your credentials stolen. So how the blockchain is managing uh, these uh, risks and concerns quite easily. It provides a the immutable system where uh, you uh, end uh, the falsification, but it also provides an encrypted database, uh, a distributed database, uh, where you, you don't have a single point of failure, uh, therefore uh, you have um, the opportunity on a peer-to-peer -peer basis to share your credentials with employers if you want to get hired or you want to continue your professional advancement or you share them with academia if you want to be mobile in your studies, if you want to crowdsource your learning paths uh, or you share them with other learners in that regard if you want to inspire them uh, based on your learning pathways or find inspirations uh, on your own. Uh, at the end of this video, I would like to wrap up the, the discussion around security by mentioning that the OS University, of course, will be uh, a, um, an open source solution. So I invite you to uh, have a look at it, provide your feedback, make it stronger and safer together, uh, make a lot of iterations upon the foundation we are launching as an alpha version in just a few months. And let's make the next of uh, these uh, videos together with you in your city, in uh, your company or institution, because we are constantly looking for early adapters to join our team. We are constantly looking for new ambassadors uh, to join our community. Uh, till the next time, uh, I'm now uh, going to grab a, a glass of the famous Guinness beer, uh, then uh, attend a few great events around uh, ad tech, uh, around innovations. I'm going to join uh, the Learning Tech Hub, also uh, uh, join the, the WOCO uh, Doc Patch Labs and Google Fund to Entrepreneurs events, have a one-to-one -one mentoring session with representative of uh, Google support for startup programs, uh, see uh, how we can cooperate together and maybe share some more of this uh, great news uh, the next time. See you around, keep in touch, cheers, bye bye.